beautiful fish. Spectacular, Terry. What a perfect morning. Although they're not always this way, it's one of the great reasons why I enjoy fly fishing. Fly fishing is a journey. It's not a destination. And like many other sports, fly fishing requires you mastering some basic skills. Don't be intimidated. In the tape to follow, we'll show you just how easy fly fishing can be. When you first walk into a fly shop, you are confronted with an astonishing array of equipment, and it can be real confusing unless you know what you're looking for. Take rods, for example. They can be a bit overwhelming. All of the different weights, lengths, and sizes. We'll try to make it a little easier for you. There's basically only two types of flies. A dry fly, which floats on the surface, and a wet fly, which is a nymph or a streamer that we fish below the surface. Here we have a box of dry flies. On this top here starting, we have terrestrials, which actually live on land and make their way into the water. This would be your hoppers, beetle, some ants, and of course here's um, a spider imitation. There are several different ways of gripping a fly rod. My favorite grip is to put the thumb right on top of the rod. My hand is way back on the grip. Fly casting is just a little different, but it's very easy. People get intimidated by fly casting, but it's really a simple thing. What we have to remember is that a fly cast is a little different compared to regular fishing because there's not a weight on the end of the line. It's the weight of the fly line that allows you to take cast more line out. 